Hello everyone, this is Davis Copes, root beer review. I never get old saying that. And today, I'm back in the basement, and today we are looking at Culver's Welcome to Delicious. You are looking at my concrete mixer. I know you are. We got some spoons. For my next trick, I'll make the shake disappear. And back to the Culver's logo. Today, I am looking at the Culver's Cocoa, Frozen Cocoa Concrete Mixer. Uh, I, I have reviewed the, the Culver's Root Beer a couple of episodes ago. And I, I thought, you know, go back to the Culver's Roots and take a look at this drink that you can get now at Culver's. It is a cocoa themed concrete mixer. So that's their milkshake. And I have some bad news. This has been sitting in my refrigerator for a cool minute and it's already kind of melted. It's all kind of, oh, oh that, was, that, was a, that was a close one. Um, uh, it, <clears throat> it's kind of melted already. It's kind of lost. I mean, I'm just, the, the whipped cream is gone. Um, but it's got it's got that good kind of ice cream consistency, but Culver's frozen con Culver's concrete mixers are usually pretty good. I usually like almost all of them, and uh, the last one I did was the pumpkin spice one, which I would argue was the worst concrete mixer that I've I've had ever. It just it was just too too much. I guess, I guess it was too much of a good thing. My hair looks bizarre. I don't know what's going on. Just kind of a, it's weirdly parted. Um, maybe I'll do the rest of you like this or like this. Um, uh, I don't know. Uh, let's see. Uh, I like, I, that looks, that looks really weird. Um, um, I guess I'll stick with that. That looks okay. I looks kind of like Princess Leia or something. Um, yeah, uh, I'm gonna stick with that for now. But um, we have the concrete mixer here and I'm very excited. I just had dinner. It wasn't Culver's dinner, but it was a, it was a delicious, a chicken like crock pot taco thing. It was really good. It was surprisingly good. Um, props to my mom. I, I, I'm sorry I doubted you, mom, if you're watching this. It was a, it was a, it was a home run. It was quite good. Um, and so I'm very excited. I, I'm a little, I'm a little, not stuffed, but I have, you know, my sister talks about how she has two stomachs, one for normal food and one for desserts. I have, the normal one is full. I'm good. But the dessert one, I can, I can always make room in that department. So... Here it is. It's it, the more I talk, the more it melts. So I guess I'm just gonna dive in and try it, shall we? So um, look at that. Um, it's just ice cream at this point. It's not really, uh, but I, I'm excited to give it a try. I think I hope it redeems itself. I hope it's better than than the the uh, the pumpkin spice one. So let, let's just give it a try. Once it, everybody knows the rules here on Dave's Cup Experience. Cheers, happy holidays. Um, it is actually a lot better than the, the pumpkin spice one. This isn't exactly, it's not, the, the pumpkin spice one, my issue with it was that it had good flavor, but it had way too much. It just had way too much. 
it had way too much going on. It was way like my throat just burned after every single bite that I had. It just every single bite that I had, it just it just burned my throat. It just it was like my throat was like Notre Dame on fire. It just every time I took a bite, it just burned my throat. I felt like I was like my throat was just you know just just my throat was just being just burned and just getting just gassed and uh this one it does tickle the back of my throat a little bit um i think that might be from the seasoning from the uh the whipped cream but i'm gonna go for another bite here i love ice cream i love um Col culver's concrete mixtures are usually really good and this is actually really good i don't think uh, i've never had this before so this is my first uh, Culver's cocoa concrete mixer, and it does, it does taste like cocoa. Let me turn the, let me take that bite here. I get the cocoa a little bit. I really don't get a whole lot of cocoa going on. It doesn't. I get it a little bit. I don't get it. I don't get it a ton. Let's see here. Come on, give me a, give me, give me a good bite here. Oh, I just bit my tongue. Bit my lip. I don't. I don't get it that much. I really don't. Um, but it's it's still good. It has that really good chocolate taste. I, it tickles my throat just a little bit. It tickles it a little bit. But this is still really good. I think it has really good flavor. I think it has, uh, honestly, as a holiday special from Culver's, this is way better than my pumpkin spice that I had. Um. The pumpkin spice, it was just too much. Too much. Worst concrete mixer of all time, in my opinion. Not bad. Not bad. I honestly give it like a three, th like a three out of ten. This is, this is actually going to be actually quite high, I think. I'm going to take another bite. I just don't know. I'm struggling to write it because it is really good. But it doesn't really, it doesn't really taste like cocoa. It just kind of tastes like a concrete, like a chocolate concrete mixer. It tastes better than a chocolate concrete mixer, though. It, it's it's odd. It's really odd because it tastes more chocolate than a chocolate concrete mixer, but it doesn't taste like hot cocoa chocolate. But it also tickles my throat just a little bit, so I don't know. I think I'm gonna give this a. A low seven, seven out of ten. It's really good. It tastes good. This is quite good. I would con actually consider getting this again. I would consider it. Not, not positive. Like, it, it, uh, I think if you're if you're gonna go if you're gonna go bacon pretzel baconator or this, I mean the pretzel bake actually that would be a good meal. That actually be a good meal. Pretzel baconator this you'd have a really good meal. Um, that might rival, actually, um, pretzel baconator, this shake, would be, that would be a better combo than the Good Burger 2 meal. Hot take, hot take there. Um, I have better things to say about these two than the Good Burger 2 meal, um, which I have tried. And this was good. I'm actually considering now, like, I need to, I need to review the Shamrock shake at some point. Um, I would love if they brought back the Grimace shake. That'd be that'd be awesome. That milkshake was so good. That milkshake blew my mind. It actually might be one of the best milkshakes I've ever had. The Grimace milkshake is actually so good in my opinion. Um, but this is quite good. If you live by Culver's, if you're a Midwesterner like myself, um, I, I'd recommend this. It's actually quite good. Mine is like just it's I can't even I don't even want to show it but like you can see that like it just it's just almost like chocolate milk at this point like a little bit bigger than that but this was a quite good a surprise from Culver's good job Culver's two thumbs up Davis approves if you're at Culver's and you're and this looks good it probably is going to be good and I would recommend it Davis approves uh, this is going to go in the clean cup club CCC um, triple C um and I, I i really liked it i think you should uh 
give it a whirl if you'd like to. Um, my hair looks weird for some reason, but it's, it's okay. It's okay. I'll stick with it. Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, I'm, I'm getting that, that's that I'm always getting to that point where it's almost new videos every single day, which is absolutely wild to me that I'm, that I'm, I'm actually getting close to that, 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 uh, that level, but stick around guys. I really appreciate you guys watching my videos. Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Give this a try if you'd like to. You might like it. I might take might take a, I might finish it off. I might take another bite. I'm not gonna finish it on camera because that would take way too darn long and we'd be here all night. But it was quite good. Thumbs up. Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Have a rest of your day, morning, evening, or night. Uh welcome to Delicious. Alright, I'll see you guys later.